Step inside a classroom at St. James School, and you'll see there's nothing new here. It looks the same as many other classrooms in this country, perhaps like classrooms in the Philadelphia area. Teachers are teaching, children are listening, absorbing, reacting, they are learning. But pull back the veil of the classroom, and you'll see much more here. The students we are educating come from a tough neighborhood. This is North Philadelphia, an area nationally recognized for being mired in educational problems. But people don't see that. They see what some call under-resourced. The nearest grocery store is 32 blocks away. Children's parents and guardians struggle daily to make ends meet. They rely heavily on cell phones low on prepaid minutes. Public transportation, local laundromats, poor lighting and lack of furniture at home, some of the simplest amenities. Now look, what do we see? Promise, hope. The power of their human spirit is being lifted every day. Even spirits that have been dimmed and can sometimes feel weighted by hopelessness find hope here. St. James School is the heart of this neighborhood and we are educating the whole child. They challenge us here. The students know that there's work to be done in every single class. They see more in you than the other teachers at my old school did. We discover our students' individual strengths and then work to nurture them. We could get tutors if we need help. We ensure that all of our students have one-on-one -on -one tutors. I feel safer here. For most, this is the safest place in their life. And it's like, I didn't have that before. In my old school, it was like a fight every day. Fights happened every day. One of the teachers made people fight. Everybody got picked on every day and I was mad. Fighting is not going to happen. Our parents and our students know that we address bullying immediately. We don't allow that nonsense here at this school. Zero tolerance for bullying. I sat around two bullies and they said, y'all, you read? And I was like, well, I had to act like I didn't. And I was like, I don't like this book at all. And I had to act like I didn't like it. No one feels ashamed to be a successful reader. We had music class, but it wasn't as fun as this one. We provide vocal training and violin study for every student. The students have six hours of art and music in a week. We get to express ourselves in many ways. If you expect them to do well, they do amazing things. My dad sees in my teacher every day to talk about my grades. Knowing where the students come from help us to make more compassionate choices. A large part of educating a whole student is building relationships with their parents and their families. One of my kids would have like 34 kids. I don't like being around a lot of kids in one stuffy classroom. Like my old school was a really big school and with a little bit of teachers and this school is really small with a lot of teachers. Student-teacher ratio is six to one. With two adults in the classroom, one teacher is able to continue instruction while the other deals with behavior problems immediately. It's about religion and praying for people. We practice what we pray. Even if they don't have a religious affiliation, the Episcopal tradition instills in them the ideals to care and respect others and a drive to be a better person. Muslims, Christians, all participate because they choose to. Everyone accepts everyone. Students don't want to lose their place in this community. Here, y'all, you guys do care about us. You guys love us. You love, you love our families. As strict as we are, we make sure the kids know we care. Support comes from the many. Teachers, volunteers, leaders, tutors, parents, board members, all who care about our young people most in need of a first-rate education. I have strengths. I will succeed. I am a St. James student. I have strengths. I will succeed. I will succeed. I have strengths. I will succeed. I am a St. James student. I have strengths. I will succeed. I am a St. James student. St. James School. Academic excellence in North Philadelphia. Your support matters. Volunteer. Donate. Share.